Before man became a hunter and made his way to the top of the food chain, the Phalidae, or cats, were the most successful, powerful predators in most of the world. Even today, big cats such as tigers, lions, jaguars, and leopards draw admiration and fear. But some of their extinct relatives dwarf these magnificent beasts. In this video, we'll be looking at 10 of prehistory's largest, mightiest cats, some of which were seen by humans only a few thousand years ago. Before we begin, make sure you hit the like button, subscribe to our channel, and click the notification bell for more amazing videos. With that being said, let's begin. Number 10. Giant Cheetah The giant cheetah belonged to the same genus as our modern-day cheetah and probably looked very similar, but it was much bigger. At around 120 to 150 kilograms, or 265 to 331 pounds, it was as large as an African lioness and was able to take on larger prey than its delicate modern-day counterpart. The giant cheetah was also adapted to fast running, but there's some debate on whether it could run as fast as the modern cheetah due to its heavier weight, which according to some, probably made it somewhat slower. Others, however, have suggested that the giant cheetah have longer legs and a bigger heart and lungs, could probably run as fast or even faster than the cheetah does today. That's over 115 kilometers per hour or 72 miles an hour. The giant cheetah lived in Europe and Asia during the Pliocene and the Pleistocene epochs. It went extinct during the last ice age. Number 9. Xenosmilus Xenosmilus is a relative of Smilodon, but instead of having long, blade-like fangs, it had shorter and thicker teeth. All of its teeth had serrated edges to cut through flesh and were more like the teeth of a shark or carnivorous dinosaur than the teeth of modern-day cats. Xenosmilus didn't strangle its prey, as cats do today. It only had to bite off a huge chunk of flesh from its victim and wait until it bled to death. A Xenosmilus's kill was much bloodier and messier than that of any big cat you might see at the zoo. Xenosmilus was a very big cat by today's standards. At 180 to 230 kilograms, or 397 to 507 pounds, it was as big as most adult lions and tigers and was much more robust, with shorter, stronger limbs and a very powerful neck. The remains of this cat have been found in Florida, along with those of giant prehistoric peccaries, which were seemingly its favorite meal. It lived during the Pleistocene period, but no one knows exactly when it went extinct. Whether it encountered humans or not is anyone's guess. Number 8. Giant Jaguar Jaguars today are rather smallish cats if compared to lions or tigers. They usually average 60 to 100 kilograms, or 132 to 220 pounds, and the largest males, recorded from South America, were around 150 kilograms, or 330 pounds, about the size of an African lioness. In prehistoric times, however, both North and South America were home to gigantic jaguars, belonging to the same species as modern-day jags, but much bigger. These giant jaguars also had longer limbs and tails than jaguars living today. Scientists believe that jaguars used to be open plain denizens, but that competition with American lions and other big cats forced them to adapt to more forested environments, where they developed their modern short-legged appearance. Number 7. Cave Lion The cave lion was a subspecies of the Panthera leo. This skilled hunter was one of the largest cats of its time, much larger than our present-day Siberian tiger and hybrid tiger, with males weighing between 270 kilograms and 320 kilograms. It was one of the most dangerous and powerful predators during the last ice age in Europe, and evidence indicates that it was feared. Interestingly, it played a role in the Paleolithic religious beliefs evident from artifacts like cave paintings and a few statuettes that depicted the cave lion as a majestic, regal beast. Surprisingly, this cat did not have a mane like the present-day lion, as indicated by Paleolithic cave paintings and clay busts. They also show the cave lion with faint, tiger-like stripes on its body. Number 6. 
Homotherium. Homotherium was one of the most successful felines in prehistoric times, found in North and South America, as well as Europe, Asia, and Africa. This cat could adapt to a variety of habitats. This pack-hunting cat adjusted to fast running and active hunting mostly during days. That is how he avoided competition with nocturnal predators. His long forelegs and shorter hind legs gave him a hyena-like appearance. Although Homotherium is not very famous for its size, some fossil remains of a scimitar cat unearthed recently in the North Sea suggest that they could reach 400 kilograms or 882 pounds in weight, being larger than modern-day Siberian tigers. They could hunt mammoths, but also chase fleet-footed animals thanks to their ability to run at a high speed. Number 5. Machiridus Machiridus was a saber-toothed cat that lived during the late Miocene in Europe, Asia, Africa, and North America. According to skeletal and life reconstructions, Machiridus coloradensis was about 1.2 meters or 3 feet and 11.25 inches at the shoulder and 200 centimeters or 6 feet and 6.74 inches in length. If accurate, this would make Machiridus one of the largest phalids. It was about a lion-sized cat but was more robust and had more muscle mass. Machiridus was probably hunting as an ambush predator. Its legs were too short to sustain a long chase, so it most likely was a good jumper and used its canines to cut open the throat of its prey. Its skull was noticeably narrow compared with the skulls of modern panthering big cats. The canines were long, thin, and flattened from side to side, but broad from front to back, like the blade of a knife. Number 4. Nandong Tiger The Nandong Tiger is an extinct subspecies of tigers that lived in what is now the Sundaland region of Indonesia in the Pleistocene epoch. The few remains of the Nandong Tiger suggest that it would have been about the size of a modern Bengal tiger. However, other specimens suggest that it was larger than any modern tiger, although Raoul Valvert later estimated the head body length to be between 172 and 233 centimeters, or 5.64 and 7.64 feet, while the total length was estimated to be 258 to 350 centimeters, or 8.46 to 11.48 feet, both taken in a straight line. The minimum weight for females was estimated at 143 kilograms, or 315 pounds with males weighing up to 368 or 811 pounds, with an, an exceptional specimen weighing up to 400 kilograms or 880 pounds. Number 3. American Lion This big cat, a probable ancestor of our present-day lion, once roamed the continent of North America. This predator was huge, more than four-thirds the size of any modern lion, Standing four feet high, this predator had a huge head and long legs. Surprisingly, this big cat weighed less than expected for something its size, between 256 kilograms and 351 kilograms. This predator lived at high altitudes, probably using caves as a shelter against the cold weather. American lions likely preyed on deer, horses, North American camels, North American tapirs, bison, mammoths, and other large herbivorous animals. Human predation may have contributed to its extinction, indicated by the huge number of lion bones found in American Indian settlements in the Paleolithic age. This prehistoric lion was truly the king of beasts in its age. Number 2. Smilodon Smilodon is one of the most famous prehistoric predators and also one of the most formidable. At least three species were living in both North and South America. The smallest species, Smilodon gracilis, was about the size of a modern-day jaguar, while Smilodon fatalis was as big as a lion. However, the South American species Smilodon populador dwarfed both of them, weighing 300 kilograms or 661 pounds on average and reaching up to 500 kilograms or 1,102 pounds when fully grown. Smilodon was not as agile as most modern-day big cats, but it was immensely powerful, with thicker, stronger limbs and neck than modern-day cats, and particularly long claws to hold on to prey. 
Its fangs could reach 30 centimeters, or 12 inches in length, and were perfect for causing mortal injury to mammoths, ground sloths, and possibly any large animal unlucky enough to be ambushed by the super predator. Number 1. Simba Kubwa, Kudakafrika While the Smilodon and others on this list may be more well known, a new species finally identified in 2019 now reigns as the largest of the prehistoric cats. Originally, based on the size of the jaw and teeth, the fossil remains were believed to have been a species of great ape. Significantly larger than a tiger, lion, or polar bear, with a skull comparable with a rhinoceros, this ancient predator cat, known as Simbacubwa cuticofrica, wasn't discovered in the field, but in a long-neglected museum drawer. Two paleontologists from Ohio University found the new species of the large mammal at the National Museums of Kenya. Simba Kubwa Kudakafrika, which means big lion from Africa in Swahili, belongs to a long extinct group of some of the largest meat-eating land mammals, known as Hyanellorine hyanodonts, which roamed Earth about 22 million years ago. Despite the name, this animal is not a lion or related to the cats. Instead, it's a member of a group of mammals who had long teeth, closely resembling a hyena, even though they are also unrelated. Based on its massive teeth, Scientists estimate that the big cat weighed about 1,308 kilograms, or 1,888 pounds. That's all for today. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share it with your friends. You can also leave a comment with what you would like to see in the following videos. Thanks for watching. See you next time.